Hi everyone, my name is Tolani and in this video, I'm going to teach you how to import, use custom lots and intro templates inside new video editing app to speed up your edits much faster. So without further ado, let's jump straight to it. So now we are on the new video editing app. First thing we have to do is to create a new composition by going to our project settings, by setting our project resolution to high as possible. Then our frame rate, you can leave it at 24 or 30. Then the preview resolution, if you are handling a big file, I will recommend you to, to lower it to 25% because I want to do color grading with lots and intro template. So I need to, what, to have high resolution that can preview it. Then your preview rendering mode, you can leave it like that. I have more tutorial that touch this aspect on how to what, set your project settings. And so you're not going to be having issue with what the playback and the rendering mode. So having set all these, you can then go back to this aspect right here. Our, as you can see, our project window is empty. Then our what, our project beam as well is empty. So what we're going to do is to click on this plus icon to import the video that we want to add this custom lot and into template on so you can show on our lot and our project window so i'm going to be clicking on this plus icon right here then i'm going to my media then go to video then i'm going to be going into my folder where i save the video the video i want to color grade so right here i'm going down here so this is the video so there is video can you see when i import it it's going to show you in your word in your project window then it's going to add it on your word on your project bin so now what we're going to be doing now is first thing you have to do is to load a prefetch on it so you're not going to be having issue with the playback rendering mode so i'm going to go into order then go to prefetch so you're going to load prefetch on the clip so you're not going to be having issue with the word rendering mode and the word playback maybe it's going to be hanging or all those kind of stuff so you can read this up in the you can read all these parameter up right here it's very explanatory so i'm going to be saving that so you see when i play it up i'm not going to have an issue with the playback everything plays smoothly so the next thing we have to do is to import the custom lot presets and the intro template into this video right. site here to give it more professional polish and make it look more hollywood and cinematic so it can be pleasing to eyes so what we're going to be doing is to hit on this plus icon right here you are not going to you are not going to this media again because this media is meant to import the video you want to edit so you're going to add on to this import you're going to see these two options right here you hit on your template so you're going to take you to take you into your folder where you save all your custom lot you can check the link in the video description i have a bunch of free node video editing lot pack and intro templates you can be using on your video to speed up your edit much faster and you can check link in the video description i have more tutorial that tell that that explain how to create your own custom lot and intro template as well so you can check that out so i'm going to be adding on into the folder that i saved my custom lot and into templates straight away mm. so here is the folder that i save all of my presets as you can see, I have lower third, I have transition, I have epic color grading, I have PM color grading, so I have a lot, I have auto color correction preset. You can find links to all these in the video description. You can download it, it's free, and load it up on your clips to make it look more clipsy and cinematic. So the one we're gonna be using on this clip is called the Cripsy Law. So I'm gonna be eating on this, hold it, it's gonna highlight it, then the template that I wanna use as well. I'm going to be using this template I called one line. I'm looking at it. I have test revealing template two line. So the one I'm going to be using is one line shape. So I'm going to be holding on it as well. So I have these two, then I'm going to select them. So node video app is going to what? It's going to decode it because it has that template stuff like this. I don't know what they actually call it. If you know it, let me know in the video the comments. So it's going to load it up in, 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 within a limit time so just give it a space so boom so now it has import this right here as you can see this is the what this is the clipsy lot i think it's not importing that template because i think it can load up that two clips at once so we're gonna be doing that later as well after we finish adding this lot on this clip right here so what we're gonna be doing now is we have the folder then we have the then we have the lot itself so we're gonna drag this out of this folder then delete this bad guy right here because it's a folder it's not the, it's not the lot then we'll click on it then move it to the front so what next we're going to do now is to add that clipsy lot color grading and color correction on this clip to make it look more cinematic so it can be pleasing to eyes so what we're going to be doing now is hold on this video right here as you can see this is before of the video but when we drag it into this custom lot awesome right can you see let me it for you in the wide window 
Now you see how creepy it looks. But if you don't like how it actually look, as I can see right here, it's having vignette. So can you see when you click on the creepy lot, it's gonna bring all the property in there in the in the creepy lot. It's gonna show you all the settings that the rightful owner of the of the lot has set to make this lot come to life. So what we're gonna be doing, you can twist it up. So now I want to twist it up. So I'm gonna come down to my vignette. I think my VN is a way high, so I'm going gonna, gonna to reduce it. I see if I reduce it, so I'm going to reduce it a little bit to give it that crispy look. I think it's okay by this right way. So when I play it, this is actually how it look. It's looking nice right now. So what I'm going to be doing now, I don't want videos to be long. So I'm going to be adding, I'm going to go into this plus icon again to import my intro template. So I'm going to be hitting on this import, then go to my template like I do. So it's going to be taking you right here so you're gonna go down to the intro templates i think i'm using that one shape so this one right here then hold on it double click on it there's gonna load the templates for you as well so give it a couple of minutes let's say so let's say your friend has custom lots and intro template that you admire that you love using on your video you can send you can tell them to send the lots presets for you so you can apply it on your video so that is how this node video editing app is a huge bonus and a huge improvement for all video creator that is out there so i recommend you guys to keep using node video editing app and check me weekly on node video editing tutorial every week and i have a bunch of tutorial you can check link in the video description that you can watch so you can be used to with this monster video editing app so now he has imports the the template when you open it up you always see the property that the owner actually add so as you can see it's adding a solid background which is this red you are seeing then the review there which is the test so what i'm going to be doing now is to click on this i don't want this background so i'm going to delete that background so now when i play it up this is what it look like can you see awesome right so what i'm going to be doing is that i don't want the review because well you can change the test so i'm going to be hitting on this review then you're going to be seeing this right here so you can what you can shape you have the shape which is the line that is running across so that we have the test so these are the property so these are the properties so what i want to do is to click on this test right here then we want to change it so i'm going to come down right here and change this test to let me say subscribe to remind you to subscribe to this channel if you gain value from it so far so as this is reminding you so i'm going to be clicking on ok so now i have this so when i play it up it's going to review that my subscribe so can you see so now when i play everything up this is how it actually look from the beginning this is how it actually look awesome right you can close all these tab right up you can close them up so you don't get confused so this is how actually everything will look as final so when we play it up so let me drag it to the beginning of the clips and let's play it up and let's see awesome right can you see how awesome it look so this is how you had your custom lot preset or template so let's say we play all these clips right here and we are okay with everything that we've set the color grading and color correction so what next we want to do is to go to your export and go to this and set your and set your resolution to 1920 and make sure it's on high and your frame rate then you want to click on this export right here so hope you guys gave a lot of value out of this video if you did please be sure to hit the like button and consider subscribing for more tutorial and please leave me a comment about what you think about this video and what you want to see next, next on this channel so i'll be willing to see you in the next video and as always i'll see you in the next video peace and be safe Bye for now.